dropped out of the first two colleges that were kind enough to accept me. As a person who came from so-called humble origins to rise to a point where I occasionally have hung out with movie stars and my books were read by presidents, I guess I would be a poster child for those who make good, very good money trafficking the myth of the self-made man. I am not a self-made man. This self was made with the help of others. My own parents, good people who kept their head down and worked two and sometimes three jobs to raise their kids and never complained. I see the world through your eyes and I think you must be bewildered because I'm bewildered. I ask myself, where do we turn for honor anymore? Just honor. Forget justice, forget truth, we'll just take honor. People and organizations acting honorably. Honor is not an impossible ideal, something beyond your grasp. Honor is day to day, it's minute by minute. If you have it, you live it without question. Honor is not doing what is easy if it hurts a single soul. Honor has no room in its house for cynicism. Skepticism, yes, always, but cynicism, no. It has no room in its house for greed, for the mindless pursuit of money or hollow success. Honor is the affirmative answer to one simple question you ask of yourself every day. Did I behave with dignity and respect toward all living things? That's the measure of honor and the measure of humanity. The measure of a human being lies in not what the world does to him or her, but rather how he or she comports herself within that world. So take your hopes and your dreams, but don't forget your hearts. Don't forget your compassion, don't forget your honor, and don't forget your empathy. Thank you very much.